Okay, we're lapping the valves. That's how you lap the valves. Use your valve grinding compound. Put it on the edge of the valve where it seals. Right there. All the way around. Just don't get any here on this shaft or in this hole. Get your tool, little plunger tool. If you can get the tool to stick, great. If not, you're gonna have problems. You always wanna make sure that when you do this, you wanna take something and clean this surface so that you can get it to stick. You just take and just light pressure, like you're trying to start a fire with a stick. You want to lift it up and drop it back down, and it'll reapply it. You can just keep doing that. This tool is a bitch to use. You'll hear it smooth out and it'll get real smooth. Keep keep going. Don't pick back up on it, just keep grinding. That'll hone it down. And pull it back out. And you gotta inspect and see if you're getting it down far enough. Wipe it all clean. Now what you're trying to achieve is there's these tiny little pits. You can see them all around, especially after you've ground it down once. I'm going to try to remove all those tiny little pits right in the surface. And we're going to go again. really should tear your motor down and do this every now and then. It really brings it back to life. And just light pressure, not hardly any pressure all about, not even the weight of both your hands on there. You're kind of almost picking up on it just a little bit. You want to try to twist it as far around as you can when you're doing it. Pull it back down. Tool gets dirty, it gets really hard to use. It's looking better. Just 
I'm not quite there yet. I don't know if you can see that on the camera or not. Tiny little pits in there. Keep on going. This grinding compound is basically the same stuff they make grinder wheels and grinder blades and all that stuff and it's mixed with water it's like a paste and it just it's like sandpaper you know basically grinding both surfaces away until they are a perfect opposite of each other so they seal One more time, I'll get it. This is basically all they do when you take your car and have the valves, you know, when you say doing a valve job, it's basically all they do to the valves other than maybe add some shims or replace some, some bad springs. They'll just go in, and, but they've got a machine that does this. And they'll replace any bad parts. nice there. Yep, that's good all the way around there. And you always, you know, want to look at this one too and make sure it's right. Yep, looks exactly the opposite of that one. That's how you do it. Thank you for watching.